it's afternoon. Oh, it might be good morning in California. Hey guys, we are back and now we're going to open viewer mail and then you'll see my swag bag from Cricut. But you have to remind me, I might forget. Who knows? Okay. Uh, let's go over here and check out. Okay, we have something to show you also. This is from Misty Corp. I want to show you. She made me open it before Easter, but it's so cute. I want to show you. She made me an apron. Well, it has these pockets. It's this. And it has uh, a plastic, she says you could, she put this in here, but it has a plastic uh, little pocket so you can put things in. Little apron for Easter. Thank you so much. And it has a little a hug band. Where'd that go? Well, it's around here somewhere. That matches that same fabric. Okay, let's check out. Let me make sure I can see all your chat better. So I'm over on this other screen. Okay, welcome everybody. I do this the first Saturday of every month. We open viewer mail, unless I don't have any viewer mail. There's been months without any, that's okay. Um, hey, Decker Harris. This video is brought to you by Decker because he is the one who sent me my opener, my envelope opener. <laughs> and we will open the Cricut swag bag. Oh, happy Easter. That's pretty. A blessing before eating Easter eggs. Lord, let the grace of your blessing come upon these eggs that may be healthful food for your faithful who eat them. And thanksgiving for the resurrection of the Lord Jesus Christ who lives and reigns with you forever and ever. Happy Easter, John and Terrence Decker Harris. Awesome, thank you. And don't know who this one is by. of work because the Cricut wrote all these but she had to change the pen she had to change each one color in design space and then look it's glitter it's the glitter gel pen on that pink it's hard for you guys to see that is so cool and this is glitter gel enjoy the little things Heather Ritchie beautiful card I like that flamingo or, it's not a flamingo. Peacock. It must be in design space. I think it is. Awesome. Thank you. And Carol Dufresne. Are you watching? I know you'll watch the replay. Ooh, it's a pull card. Happy Easter from Carol. Isn't that cute? It's a little penguin of uh, bunny ears. And then this will go back. There we go. I have a file like this I share with my supporters. I got to think of more cards to make with this. These are fun. Love making these cards. Thank you, Carol. It's really pretty. Joy Sloan, I know you were in the last video. Are you here too? Oh, awesome. This is, this, now people are calling this a braided card, but we called it a lattice card. So I have this card file 
in uh, the files I share also. Happy birthday. May your blessings you give to others return tenfold. Thank you so much, Joy Sloan. These are pretty. I love the little flowers on there. Isn't that cool? Those cards are so fun. And this has glitter. You colored in maybe with Wink Estella or one of those glitter. Can you see the glitter? And it, it's not glitter. It's actually just, I think, one of those markers that have like the glittery on it. It's really pretty. And that's embossed. Hi, Joy. Okay. This one was written by the Cricut. I can tell. So cool. Oh, and look, she embossed the envelope. Love that. We know it's a birthday card. I wanted to make sure I wasn't ripping the card. Because look at the pretty paper. Happy birthday. I like that. I have learned so much from you since joining your group last July. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh, I love this. Melody, you are wonderful post. Can't speak. You are a wonderful person. I hope you your special day is the beginning of an amazing year. Thank you for all you do. Have a great birthday. Hugs and kisses, Nancy. Thank you so much. It was wonderful, and uh, this is so pretty. It's kind of glittery. That paper. It's like a pearl essence paper. In foil paper. It is just the beginning of a wonderful year. So many exciting things are happening this year. Okay, now this one is uh, from Debbie O'Neill. She's also a Cricut product expert. And she, she meant to send this, but then things happened and it never got sent. Uh, so she gave it to me in Utah yesterday. Uh happy birthday and she designed this card look isn't that a pretty card it's fun and pretty celebrating you have a wonderful birthday melody debbie o'neill see how it stands isn't that pretty and it's fun this is my exercise. This is really, really strenuous exercise. Kidding. Very pretty. Thank you, Debbie. And we have one here from Rhonda. the deco uh, foil the rainbow one it's so pretty I love it and look at the dog and cat okay I pointed to the cat and said dog but I dog and cat I do know the difference and glitter paper and glitter ribbon so pretty oh wow oh she says you're you're May your loss be lessened when you think of her playing at the Rainbow Bridge. Oh, thank you for being so patient with those you teach. Your skill and design savvy are amazing. Taking me along for a cyber ride across the U.S. is in a Tesla means more to me than you know. I am so happy to hear that. 
Uh, Melody, you are a blessing and shining star. Wishing you continued success and happiness. Hugs for a happy day. Oh, Fatima, thank you so much. For those of you that don't know, I ha I lost one of my dogs. I had to put her down. Thank you so much. That's so pretty. And thank you for mentioning you enjoyed the Tesla ride. A lot of you enjoyed it, but some people complain if I put a video on that is not crafty. But that's who I am, and I share my life with you. So I take you on golf cart rides and things, because people ask for them, to be honest. This is so pretty. <laughs> it says, translation, you're a cool chick. And look. Look at how awesome that is. That is awesome. I might have to make some cards like this. And the butterflies are in little pieces of acetate. So they float. Chirpy, chirp, chirp. Awesome. Love these. There's little chicks with Easter with bunny ears. That is so cute. Love this. Made by Lindsay. Happy Easter. Love. The paper is so pretty. That is so cool. Is that fun? Peggy's asking how many product specialists. They're, we're called Cricut Product Experts, and there are nine of us. I have to separate these. I don't want to miss any. Okay. This is by Adeline Cooper. Oh, this is pretty. Happy birthday wishes to you, and I hope your day was extra special. Uh, you have been a blessing to so many of us, and I just wanted to let you know we appreciate you so very much. Love, Adeline. Thank you. That's so pretty. Such a pretty card. Handmade by Adeline. I need to do something with this light in my camera thing because it's right in the way. Thank you so much. I think that's all of them. So is that it for the video? Should I go now? Or do you want to see my swag bag? I don't think there's any secrets in here. I just took a folder out. I didn't take anything else out. Okay. Oh, and there's a notebook in here. I didn't even see the notebook till it was all over. They gave us a book to write notes in. Okay, so they gave us, thank you, Ronald. Ronald's so amazing. We got some pins. A little Cricut. This is a coffee mug. It says, but first crafting. And this says, I'd rather be crafting. And you can find these images in Cricut Design Space. They look just like these pins.
in a bag. It says love with a little cricket. Isn't it cute? Okay, let's see what's inside. Okay. First, they made each of us a cup with our name on it. Is that awesome? Thank you, Cricket. You guys are amazing. Okay, and then pattern iron on. And I don't know if you guys can't see these patterns very well. But there's three different patterns. There's a darker one. And then, um, well, should we just open it? taped up well you can see there's one this is like white and black with branches that's pretty isn't that cool no they do not sell those pins those pins uh, you can only get when you go to cricket events here's I got these when I went to Mountain make fun The past two Mountain make thons is what's in here. I just found those before I left. So I'm like, where did I put those? Natalie Milan Premium Vinyl. These are pretty. It looks like two of each color. See, look, they made a, they put it on a birdhouse. How pretty is that? Isn't that pretty? Three different colors. People ask, well, what do you do with this? You can do anything you want. You stick it to anything. I like it on the birdhouse. And, oh my gosh, this is a sampler pack. The mesh. Now, I bought some mesh, and I want to do a project with the mesh iron on, but this is glitter mesh. I haven't received this yet. This is gold red and silver awesome they made a pineapple here so i want to use this stuff and put it on a card that glitter mesh is awesome and something you can't find everywhere else and some holographic oh this is iron on Holographic iron on. And there's three of them. Three 12 by 12. And they're different colors, I think. They look a little slightly different. So I can't wait to use that. Awesome. Some foil acetate. We all know I like already purchased a whole lot of this one. This is so pretty. I've already shown these in a video. This is clear acetate, but then like this has like holographic circles on it. Isn't that pretty? They're so pretty. And then it has different shapes. Like this one is like that design. You see that design? They're so pretty. That's really pretty. This is the pinpoint sampler. This is my favorite one. Isn't that awesome? And then uh, Everyday Iron On, the samplers, and their Everyday Iron On, their Iron On stuff is guaranteed. It's awesome. So this is nice if you don't need a huge big roll. It comes in these and how long are these? I forget. 24 inches. So they're three and a half inches by 24 inches. And this is a way to collect a lot of different colors and not spend a whole lot of money because you get three colors in one. 
and you don't you're not paying for a big huge roll when all you need is a little bit oh Kathy's asking how do you put iron on on a card you just I'll use my easy press you can iron on to paper and basswood I already have some of this and I'm just not sure what to make yet so if you guys want to see me make something with the basswood let me know I don't know if this is, yeah this is two sheets of basswood look they made coasters they cut some to put on uh, a card for the tree trunk they made Australian image awesome can't wait to use it okay and then this you guys I already have this because you know it's amazing craft board 30 sheets of holographic craft board now I'm not gonna open that right now but I will show you the craft board because I already have it open oh and there's my ibuprofen <laughs> I was looking for that earlier okay I'm gonna show you the craft board I already have it over here and my favorite part of the craft board is that it's on white craft board. And my assistant made a box while I was gone out of the craft board. I'm like, we gotta make something out of it with that craft board. So she made one of my boxes. So I'm gonna show you the colors first. Isn't that cool? And the back is white. It's really kind of stiff. It's great for boxes. This is my favorite. And then they made this little box, the lid, and they cut out all the hearts and put in there. But um, this box is one of my designs I did in Design Space. And I'm like, let's make a little holographic box. That awesome and that's it my gosh there's lots of questions make a holder for all the Cricut pens okay do you guys want to see my Cricut pens I, I don't think I can make a holder that big it's um holographic craft board uh jessica asked can you cut your name with that wood and use it as a necklace or keychain i would say no the reason is when you're cutting with the knife blade it can't be too um intricate it needs to be a little bigger and the wood is actually more delicate than the uh, ch cricket chipboard uh, the I don't have a link to the box the box is on my blog melody lane inspired .com. you have to have a password to get it if you go to projects by type maybe 3d images the box is called a diamond box and there's a couple of files this one has hearts but there's also sizes like I have bigger sizes like a pretty big size um, of the box too that you can do with 12 by 24 paper uh, what was I gonna show you Yeah, the basswood is for the maker only. Somebody, oh, the pens. I knew you want to see something like okay let me okay 
here's some pens I have not put away yet. I have to check and see if I have these. I, I think I might already have these pens, but I have to check because I don't have room for duplicate pens in my pen holder anymore. I had to clean them all out. Okay, so I have my pens in here. The pens from here on are all Cricut. And then these are some other pens at the end that will fit in the Cricut, but they're not Cricut brand. So I use mostly all of these. And I got this thing. This came in another thing. You can't buy this on its own. It came in another thing from Michaels from the Recollections collection. Um, it has two shelves and one of them had this in it and then it has two drawers underneath. It's on my desk behind my computer. I can't really show it right now, but um, I just take this out and set this over on the side of my table. And so I have to keep making room for more pens, so I have no room for duplicates. But I love my Cricut pens. They make me happy. Yeah, if you guys want, uh, give me suggestions on what you want me to make with the basswood, let me know. Put them in the comments below the video or the comments on Facebook. All right, guys, I think I'm going to go let you go. I'm going to go let you go gonna let you go uh leave me a comment below tell me what you want me to teach you tell me what you want me to make what you want your next class on give me ideas i need to i want to do them for you so uh tell me what you want to see all right guys love you and i will see you tuesday i think oh a 3d flamingo that would be fun. All right. Bye, guys.